welcome if you are watching one of my videos for the very first time or welcome 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 back if you are subscribed and have seen a prior video if you do not know i am victoria and i consider this to be my universe so i'd like to welcome you all to victoria's universe sorry if i was just talking fast i felt like that was kind of fast Today I'm going to a brunch, so I hope you all enjoy this video. It's a small business. I believe they're considered a small business, and it's something local, so I thought I would support. Um, I've been hearing good things about them, and they recently opened, so uh, hopefully I recorded enough to make this a legit video, um, but yeah, I hope you all enjoy this, and stay tuned for more to come. I have a lot more that I'm trying to do as far as my channel is concerned. Um, and also with just social media in general i kind of been kind of like mm, on and off of social media because um, i just lost my train of thought um it's my first time going so hopefully it's good let's see how it is alert 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 <laughs> so basically this video was supposed to be like a cute little weekend brunch video but i only got like two legit minutes of me um actually out at brunch so this is going to now be a random little quick weekend uh weekend with me type of vlog so i hope you all enjoy let's get into it so the place we went to was called skillet why i just said it like that i don't know but i hope you all enjoy all of the one minute and 45 seconds that i recorded um yeah <laughs> I really enjoyed the atmosphere and it's BYOB, which I know a lot of people like. Um, they do advertise that they have little like selfie stations, but tables were in front of them. So couldn't really take pictures, but it was still really cute. The food was really good and the mimosas were bottomless, which we love. Um, I Next time I go, I do want to try their wraps. They have like breakfast food and then more like brunch lunches, lunch-ish type stuff. And they both, well, not both because I didn't have both, but... It, they all seem really good and then for some reason one of the girls who worked at the restaurant thought it was somebody at our table's birthday um it wasn't but that was funny something else i like it was that the waiters were attentive um some places you order and then you won't see the waiter until the check comes um these people kept kind of like seeing if he was enjoying everything if you wanted another mimosa you know how he was feeling everything and i actually really liked that because it seemed like they actually cared about the customers and cared to have people come back So when I was by the restaurant, I wanted to take some pictures because there's some really nice artwork in the area, but it was drizzling, so I didn't have time to do that. And then once it the once like the rain cleared up, it was really nice out. So I decided to go to a local park and it was really nice. A lot of people were out, um, people with their dogs, people just walking, people just enjoying the weather, things like that. Um so here's just some random clips of me in front of the camera. Um yeah. <laughs> And I thought this tree looked really nice. I know certain flowers, but not a ton. And this tree just caught my attention for some reason, especially with all the petals on the ground. But yeah, I just thought it was a pretty tree. And I don't know if anybody else is like this. My brain is constantly just like creating things in my head. So um, I was pretty much just walking around in front of the camera, imagining I was in a movie. And that's that. Can somebody say main character syndrome? <laughs> As y'all can see, I was super fascinated with these flowers. I really don't know what type of tree this was. Um, the flowers were, like, the petals were huge. And they, like, wrapped around one another. I don't, I really don't know what it is. But I think I want to find out. <laughs> and here I go again in front of a bush. So here's a clip of me. I went to see a show. It was a really good show, but it was kind of long. Um, I still really enjoyed it, and I was glad I got invited to go see it. I haven't been to a theater in so long, and although I don't necessarily act, um, it really just made me realize how much I miss performing and just being in creative spaces. I 
haven't been to Ulta in a little minute, but I saw this palette and thought it was super duper cute. And then I saw this Key skincare, which I'm thinking about trying. Let me know if you've tried it. <clears throat> Don't mind how I look, but I went to Ulta and picked up a few things. So I'm gonna show you all what I got. If you have TikTok or Instagram, then you know a lot of people have been liking the Milani setting sprays. Um, they were advertising the regular one, but I already have the sunscreen one. So I figured the matte one will be good to use for the upcoming summer weather. Let me know if you've used it and tried any of them. I haven't used a ColourPop brow pencil in so, so, so long, so I'm really hoping I like this one. Uh, lately, I've been using NYX, and it's been working well for me, but I want to try something different, so I went back to ColourPop. So the last time I wore lashes, I accidentally ripped my real lashes like off a little bit with the falsy. Um, don't know how it happened. Actually, I do know how it happened, but moving past it. <laughs> um but yeah uh i was looking for a serum and i happened to see this one so i got it and i've also been looking for these next two products for forever but because of tiktok they are always sold out and i didn't want to buy it online so i had to wait until i finally found them in store i'm really really hoping i like them um i like elf's other products so i figured i would like this as well hopefully it wasn't a mess a miss that i've been waiting to get I'm not a huge fan of cream products in the summer, so I got this to try. Uh, hopefully, I like it. I've heard good things about it. And I love exfoliating bath sponges and towels, so I got this. I really like this brand's products, and you can use it multiple times, so I had to get it. So I went to the beauty supply store and I saw this hair. The green is similar to a color I was going to use in a different style and I thought it was super cute. Um, let me know if you've used the got to be glued wax. I just, it was my first time seeing that. I decided to come to Big Lots. Don't really need much so hopefully I can find everything in here and then I'll be done for the day. I wanted to change the lights that are on my wall so I got these. Fingers crossed that I like them. So I went to Fly Below to see what they have, but they didn't have much, so I went over to Dollar Tree, um, got a few things, not much. Is it just me or does anybody else also love Fly Below because it has a bunch of random things in it that are like useful, but also you really don't need, but they're also super cute and because they're super low in price, you're like, I should get that. <laughs> And then I saw these. I absolutely have no use for any plushies, but I thought they were the cutest thing ever. Um, and like I said before, everything's cheap, so <laughs> um, it, it, it really tempts you to get them. And this is a newer Fabulo in my area. Um, so they really have stuff like super nicely laid out. They had some new home stuff that I thought was really cute that I decided to check out. I didn't get anything, um, but yeah, I still, I always still just enjoy walking around stores. I don't know why, mm, it's an strange addiction. And that floral lamp looked just like when I saw it at Ikea, so I thought that was pretty interesting. And clearly Barney was my inspiration for my socks and shoes of the day. Many will feel personally attacked by this bag. So I look like a greasy mess, don't mind it. But it's been a smooth and productive week. I hope you all enjoyed this video, although it didn't really go as planned and it's probably gonna be pretty short. Um, but I hope you all enjoyed. Subscribe, like, comment, share, 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 and stay tuned for more. Continue to be happy, blessed, and beautiful. Mm -hmm.